Okay, so today I wanted to show you guys how to edit an artwork so that the quality image is professional and high detail and perfect lighting and all of that stuff. So I wanted to do a really good example of this with one of my photographs of a painting that happens to be angled a little off. You see how the painting is actually not straightforward and center in the photo. We can actually take this and make it completely as if I had photographed it straight on and with a high quality camera. So let's begin. If you have any experience with Photoshop or no experience with Photoshop, you can still kind of go along with what I'm doing. Every step is very simple and you can see as you follow along with me. So let's begin. So the first thing we are going to do is I'm going to actually crop this image a little bit more so we don't have any of this excess unimportant information in the photograph. So I'm going to go to my rectangular marquee tool and I'm going to click on that. And this is where I can select any selection of the photo. See, I've only got the painting in this. And then I'm going to go to image crop. There, that took everything out. Now here's the fun part, and this, the part that is kind of amazing sometimes for people who have never seen this before. We can actually go in and rearrange the way this artwork in the picture is positioned, and nothing is going to be damaged in the process. Now we're going to go to Edit, Transform, Distort. Now this is where we can go in with our little cursor here and click on this, hold it, and move the picture in the direction we need it to go. And you just keep doing that until you get it completely in the photo as you want it, straight forward. Sometimes you have to go back to each corner as you're done. I'm actually going to click enter because I can't reach this one down here anymore. And I'm going to redo that. So I'm going to click once with this rectangle thing, do it again, and then go back to edit and distort. Now it's just where I want it. I'm going to click enter. And now see the painting dead on it looks square, and that's not that's not the correct um, sizing or shape of the actual painting I photographed. So we're going to change that a little bit and fix that now that it's straight on. That's just what, something that happens when you use distort. And so we're going to go in, edit, transform. And we're only going to pick, actually, we're going to go to Free Transform, and then Pull Down. Click Enter. And now we want to get rid of the space here that this created, because we only want the painting. So we're going to crop that out. We leave it selected, as it already is. Go to Image, Crop. Now it's perfect. Now, you see, we need to do some adjusting with the, the lighting and the color and make it really pop as if the painting is right in front of you. So we are going to edit the colors and the contrast and all that fun stuff. It's going to be very simple. It's really to your preference, but I'm going to show you what I do when I edit this piece. So we are going to go to Image, Adjustments, and Levels first. This is where I'm going to change the lighting up a bit and make it a little bit more perfectly toned. I'm going to darken it down and then brighten it up. Now we're going to change the saturation so that it's a little more accurate. We're going to go to Image, Adjustments, Hue and Saturation. And I'm going to adjust it till I feel it's in the correct range of the original painting. Click OK, and we're done. Now you have a perfect image of a painting.